The user progress is a way for you to view student activity in the course throughout the semester. To access the, use, the user progress, click on the reports tab on the nav bar and choose user progress. The class progress window will appear. This provides a listing of all the students in the class and by default gives you a quick idea of the content, topics, visited, objectives, logins, and grades. If you click on a student's name, it'll drill down into more detail. A progress summary will be shown. The summary progress shows the grades, objectives, content, discussions, posts, Dropbox submissions, quiz submissions, checklists, surveys, and login history. Click on any one of these provide more detail about the student progress for that particular area. So for example, if I wanted to see Dropbox, for example, and I click on that, it'll show me more details about that the student has submitted once and this will give me details about what their submission is and if I graded that specific submission I can click on quizzes and drill down to that information and immediately get to see what their attempt is and if I click on that attempt this will very quickly allows me to see how they did on that specific quiz. So the user progress area is very very useful. There is another way to access the user progress area and that's via the class list. So if I click on the Communicate tab on the nav bar and click Class List, if I choose the context menu next to any student's name and choose View Progress, it will give me the same level of detail that I just saw in the last screen. You should know that any time you see the icon, let me go back to the class list, any time you see this icon, that's how you know you can view the student's progress because you can actually do it from the gradebook also. If I go to enter grades on the gradebook, you'll notice that right there is that icon and that will take me into the student progress also.